SARA stands for Senior Affordable Rental Apartments, and it is a relationship with uh, social service agencies and private property developers to transition homeless seniors from the shelter system into permanent low-income housing. Wonderful one-bedroom apartment, nice um, luxury building with nice tenants. So in all of our development, developments, 30% of the units are assigned to formerly homeless seniors. Jas is on site day one to help welcome them into their new homes. I was healthy and active. I was living in Queens and working in Yonkers, believe it or not. But I didn't mind though, because I, you know, I was a vigorous, active man, I worked all my life. But the neighborhood I moved into was between two highways under the landing path of jets and a block away from a water pollution plant. My doctor said, what do you, what do you expect, Randall? No matter which way the wind blows, you get pollution. And that's what brought back your asthma. With any physical exertion, I begin to become winded. I was crushed, yes. And because uh, I, had, I had a double whammy. A, I couldn't work, and B, I wasn't able to maintain the rent. So I was evicted. And I had to move into the homeless shelter, shelter system. I was dejected and heartbroken. And For many, it's purely financial. Uh, they were working and they became disabled, had an injury, had a stroke, and simply couldn't get back on their feet quick enough and depleted their savings. It's a situation that can happen to any of us who are working today, including us in this room. And studies show that a homeless senior loses about 10 to 15 years off of their life expectancy due to the stress of being homeless and being in a shelter system. Um, so our goal here is to obviously extend that in the best way possible. Initially in the beginning, the tenant coordinators do meet with them um, more frequently than normal, um, just to help them acclimate to the community, the neighborhood, the surroundings, the buildings. I was interviewed and um given the keys and the laundry card, and this wonderful apartment in this glorious building. Oh, it was like floating on air. Oh, yes, indeed. It's life-changing. Many of these seniors have been in the system for anywhere from a year to 10 years. A lot of them express a lot of joy over having a set of keys where they actually have the right to close their apartment door and, and the right to privacy. It was magic. It was like, do you remember when you were five years old and you still believed in Santa Claus, and you were running down the hallway in your pajamas with your bare feet toward the living room with the Christmas tree, because you knew Santa Claus had put the presents under the, under the Christmas tree. It felt like that. Over time, you can see just the stress come off of them, and you can see they just look calmer, at peace, and at ease. They start to take pride in decorating their homes. It had, it had um, that sofa, that table, two chairs, a bed with a mattress, yes, and a chest of drawers, um, pillows and sheets and a nice big warm blanket. Oh, wow, just wonderful. And the kitchen, oh, I can't say good things about the kitchen. If you see his kitchen, it's all black and red, pots and pans, toaster. We're here for seniors that came from the shelter system and that are moving into these apartments and we follow up with them, we provide the services that they need. See, I, I, I'm not as computer literate as I would like to be. And she, she is my resource for that. They don't know anything that has to do with automatic payment or anything like that. Many tenants say is that the tenant coordinators become like their grandkids. They feel like they're their grandkids that help them with anything technologically related. I fainted when I came to crawl over and pull this pull chain, and EMS came. You're helping really deserving people get back on their feet again. All of the tenants that I see here are really nice people that have just had disasters in their lives. So you're really helping deserving people. I've, um, for 30 years, I was in security. I was a fire inspector, and I really served this, this land good. And now, thanks to Jaffa and organizations like them, I'm being helped in my old age. Thank you.